to my channel. My name is Paige and today I'm going to be sharing with you 10 different baby names. I got five boys and five girls. If you know by now, you know that we are expecting a girl this fall, but I love baby names. I have always loved baby names. This is not my first baby name video here on my channel. I will link all the other ones down below. I love names. I don't know what it is about names. I've always loved putting like different names together. So you guys really enjoyed the last one I done. I combined a first name with a middle name because I feel like sometimes you get that one name and you can't figure out another name to go with it. So I decided to make it a little bit easier for you if you're trying to decide your baby's name or you want to like get some names down like in a notebook for you to use later. This is the perfect place for you. For those of you wondering what our baby's name is, you're going to have to wait until she is born. We are not sharing the name. Some of you may understand that, some of you might not, but it's totally okay. So before I get any questions down below, I wanted to go ahead and address that now. So I have all of the baby names listed in a note on my phone. Before I get started, if you've never seen my face before and you enjoy today's video, please make sure to give it a big thumbs up and also subscribe before you leave so you can see future videos from me. Okay, I think we're gonna start with all the boys first. We're gonna go ahead and get all the boys out of the way and then we're gonna do the girls just because I want. So the first boy name combination I have is Colson Wade. I love it. I feel like those are two names from two different TV shows. Wade is from Heart of Dixie and I cannot remember where Colson is from. Oh, Colson, Avengers. Yeah, Agent Colson. That's <laughs> Colson Wade. I don't know why I tend to like southern names or I always throw in like a southern something in there in the name. So you might notice that with some of these names, but I think Colson Wade is super adorable. This next boy name is definitely southern, Knox Henry. I love Knox. It was actually on my list of boy names that I loved, but my husband did not. All of these names I love, obviously, or I wouldn't be sharing them. But a lot of them, my husband totally vetoed. He was like, nope, don't like that. Don't like the way it sounds. What kind of name is that? Those are literally the responses I got sharing my different name ideas. So trust me when I say naming this baby was a feat in itself. So, Knox Henry, I think, is regal. Of course, it's sophisticated sounding, but yeah, definitely Southern. If you like that Southern charm, fit on a name that one's definitely perfect for a little boy holden tate i am one that loves to balance like a short name and a long name i've always been that way probably because my name's a short name and a long name i don't know um but i love the balance of them and i'm super huge on syllables like i try to make sure that it sounds right you have to say a name out loud like as if your child has done something wrong not that we're claiming this is going to be a bad child but eventually they're going to do something that you don't want them to do right so you got to be able to say it out loud and it sounds good you also have to be able to write it out on paper and it looks good those are like my top qualities when i'm looking for a good baby name number four for the boys is rhett anderson i absolutely love rhett yes southern thomas rhett everybody comments on videos and says that my husband looks like thomas rhett we've also gotten comments here lately that say he looks like drake and i don't see that at all i think it's the beard i more so see thomas rhett than i see drake Comment down below if you think he looks like one or the other. But I absolutely love Rhett Anderson. I also like Rhett Alexander, but Rhett Anderson, I liked Anderson a little bit better than I did Alexander. I don't know. Which one do you think you like better? And the fifth and final one for the boys is going to be Warren Jude. I love, I don't know why I love that. It's like Warren to me is more like laid back, but I feel like Jude is more of a sophisticated name. Maybe it's because of the actor Jude Law and I just always feel like he's just sort of regal and fancy. I don't know, but together I think they make the perfect little boy or grown man combination. I've said that in numerous baby name videos before. If it doesn't sound good as a grown up and only as a baby, I mean, you gotta find something that fits them through their entire stages of life. Now let's go ahead and get into the girl names. My first one is Eloise Rose. I have always liked Eloise. Of course, that's another one that Cody vetoed. He did not like it. He is not a fan of somewhat unique sounding like spunky names. I love like quirky, unique sounding names that are still like a name. I don't want to give like our child like some random name that I made up. 
<laughs> because growing up, I hated that I could never find my name on anything. Of course, nowadays you can customize anything and put whatever you want on it. So obviously it's a lot easier to come up with your own name nowadays, but we still wanted to stick with like a normal name. But I love, I love quirky different names. And Eloise Rose, I feel like was such a nice balance of two different more of a traditional kind of non-traditional names together. I think it's adorable. Number two is Magnolia Joy. Super, it just screams Southern. Super duper Southern. I absolutely love it. I think Magnolia Joy is making sweet tea. Like, <laughs> I could hear it plain as day. I think it's so cute. I think I got Magnolia also from Heart of Dixie if you're not seeing a trend here. I so wanted to throw like a George Tucker or something on this because I think George Tucker is like, one of the most cutest boy names ever, but obviously that's guy's name off of Heart of Dixie. They have like the greatest names on that show. So if you're looking for a real Southern twang kind of name, make sure you check that show out. But Magnolia Joy, I think is just perfect. It's the perfect length in syllables. It goes so good together. I think it's adorable. Number three is Henley Grace. I feel like Grace is such an easy name to pair with other names. If you're looking for something and you can't find nothing, I always feel like Grace is always a go-to. And it's such a beautiful feminine name. I think it is wonderful to go along with Henley. So Henley Grace, I think is a wonderful option for a baby girl. This is another like quirky name, but I absolutely love it. And it is Winnie Blake. I don't know, it just came to me like late at night. I love Winnie as a girl's name. I think it is funky, but cute. I feel like it's gonna grow really well. Baby stage, you know, middle school stage and then adult stage. I think it's really cute. I mean, obviously maybe in the adult stage, Winnie might be a little more difficult to use. I don't know. I feel like it's definitely cute and I would totally use it totally use it but again my husband would immediately look at me if i even brought the name up to him i know better than to bring this name up to him he would bring up winnie the pooh and that would be it but i thought winnie blake was fantastic and number five for the girls if you can't tell i love the like funky funky unique names and i feel like i always throw them more so on the girls than i do on the boys but poppy ray I love Poppy as a girl's name. I've always loved it. When Trolls came out and Princess Poppy was on there, I'm like, yes, Princess Poppy. Yes, girl, swing that hair back and forth. I love Poppy Ray. I don't know, I feel like the Ray kind of like sophisticates the Poppy a little bit. I don't know. Tell me what you think about Poppy as a person's name and not necessarily a character from Trolls. All right, so make sure you leave me a comment down below of your favorite boy name and your favorite girl name. And this can be something that you created yourself, something that you've seen on TV, something you read online, anything. I know there are other expectant mothers that watch these videos here on YouTube to get some inspiration when it comes to naming their baby. I know that I've watched quite a few of them. We were trying to figure out what this girl's name was going to be. So make sure to leave a comment down below because I know it will be super helpful for other moms. Like I said, if you did enjoy this, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for future content. And I hope you guys have a beautiful and blessed day, y'all. Bye! Feels good to be back. Feels good to be back. Honey, I'm a sweating up a storm. What in the world? Hormones. Somebody should hire me to come up with baby names because I feel like I'm I'm real good at this. This <laughs> <sighs> what? This is gonna be a long summer, okay? Cuckoo ca choo! Hello darkness, my old friend. <laughs> That's a wrap, Jack! <laughs>